Hey, so this is just a quick video of the X-Flight AHARS system that I just installed. Uh, I am going to go to the full autopilot system, but uh, I've had this sitting around in the box for six months and decided it was time to get it installed. So uh, just a real quick overview. Um, so that's the unit. And it takes about a minute, about 60 seconds to boot up. That's being run by a Raspberry Pi. So there's an SD card in there that they give you with software. And there's a USB cable that comes over to the AHARS reference unit, which is actually for RC airplanes. And it's got an SD card in it. And this is where your GPS antenna plugs in. And I believe that module there is just power conditioning. They also sell a power conditioning module to power the Raspberry Pi, which I purchased. Seems to be pulling about three and a half to four tenths of an amp so not very much power seems to work pretty well I'll do some turns here with it and some climbs and descents so once you have the autopilot which is a trim tab, one uh, tab on the aileron and one tab on the elevator, you get that screen. And I think it'll do, uh, well, I don't want to quote, I don't remember exactly everything. I believe it will do uh, like wings level and altitude hold. Uh, it has a home button, so if you're headed back home, you can just hit that, and I believe when it you get there it just circles the airport <clears throat> once you uh, get to your destination um, there is flight management software uh, that you use called mission planner this is where you would do your flight planning uh, i believe this is also where you would uh, do f software updates that kind of stuff so basically you're going to Hook a USB cable between your laptop and that point right there where the Raspberry Pi comes in. Um, if you're doing things with the reference unit. So that's just a real quick, um, like I said, I've had this for six months. I just finally got it installed and I've started to read the manual and play with it. So there'll be more updates. Uh, when I get uh, a little more knowledgeable on it.